Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you some of the new social publishing updates to Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2018. Here in my timeline, I've made a fall GIF of the Gao logo. So it's just comprised of two layers. The first layer here is just the looping video that I got from Pond5. And above, I just created a, a shape with a stroke as well as the Gal text. So what I wanna do is publish this to Facebook directly to my Facebook page as a GIF. So I can go up to File and I can go to Export Media. And now under Format, you can choose rather than H.264, which is the format for .mp4 files, I can choose Animated GIF. And what this does is it'll just export it as a GIF and we no longer have to go the route of exporting it as a .mp4 and then using some sort of third party software to convert it to a GIF. But now under the publish feature, there's some great new updates. Before you could only publish to your personal Facebook page, but now you can publish directly to a page that you manage, which was much needed. So from here, I've selected the Premier Gal page and I can give it a title saying, Happy Fall, the perfect season to stay inside with hot cocoa and video edit. And here I will change it to public and you can delete the local file after upload if you want, but I will not because I want it to save directly into my project folder. And then I will just hit export and it will just take a few seconds to encode the GIF itself and it will publish directly to my Facebook page. Once it's done uploading to Facebook, I will show you a few more updates to the publish tab here inside of the export settings. All right, so I'm here on my Premier Gal Facebook page and it looks like the GIF was successfully published by Adobe Media Encoder. And all that took was just a few minutes and we didn't have to go onto Facebook to upload it, which is pretty cool. Okay, so there's a couple more social publishing updates inside of the export settings. So let me just go back to export, media, and let's say we had to export this as a MP4 for YouTube, but if I scroll down to YouTube now, there's more updates here. So you can log into your account, you can choose a channel, and you can publish directly to a playlist before you cannot do that. Also, you can add your title, description, privacy settings, and tags. And a new update that I'm really excited about is you can actually attach a custom thumbnail. You can choose a frame from the source video. Once you click on that, you can then choose a time code here and then click on use current frame and it will grab this still that we're seeing as a thumbnail. You can also choose an image from a file. So if you created a custom thumbnail in Photoshop, you can just attach it here, which is super nice. And then when you hit export, it'll publish directly to your channel. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. If this video helped you out, give it a thumbs up and head over to patreon.com slash premiergal to leave me a monthly tip. If you guys have any tutorial requests, go over to premiergal.com slash tutorials and leave your requests there. Thanks again for watching, you guys, and I'll see you all very soon.